love Toronto. I think it's it's a great little. It's kind of a little sister city to to Melbourne. It's you know I get a real Melbourne flavour when I'm here. Having these guys who obviously are now based in America and working in LA and having them come back over and work with Australians, it's, you know, we're all, there's a sort of a simpatico and a, I guess a brotherhood or a sisterhood, <laughs> both. Um, so it's, yeah, camaraderie that's, that's really lovely. I've done some, you know, bigger studio films, American films, um, and you're such a tiny piece of that puzzle. And then you come to Australia and you shoot like an, a real Australian independent film is just a beautiful beautiful freedom in the collaboration that you have with one another. I know I felt very much like Creve yeah. just gave us the reins and let us kind of find our characters and have a lot of say and that's like really liberating as an actor. We've got a very small industry compared to obviously to America and there's great things and you know not so great things about that but the great thing is that there is a you know as a crew we, it's a very egalitarian you know everyone is able to contribute and ha if any, anyone has a good idea or if any anyone wants to do something yeah. it's it, yeah and they, they can it's not demarcated so it's a very fluid very open um, collaboration you know there's an access to people in Australia that is very very comfortable mm -hmm. you know? we shot in Margaret River which is so majestic and beautiful. I mean, I know these guys were surfing all the time. Oh, and yeah, I mean, it's, post, it's postcard perfection. And it becomes a character in this film. I think, you know, that, that, the background of some of these, these, well, most of the film, it's just amazing. But I guess, you know, the casting of them was something that uh, came from my reaction to the screenplay in that, you know, he was written as a pretty generic hitman and I felt like the script was so much fun and I thought it'd be really interesting to cast against type and uh, I felt a comedian has to play this role and eventually one of the producers, Larry, suggested Simon and I went, that's genius and we sent it to him and he loved the script and uh, you know, the rest is history. I, I've been here as part of an entourage, I've never been <laughs> this side. Hemsworth. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's a real blessing to have Chris and Liam who have been through that whole process. Um, and they're the best sounding boards for any advice that I, I need. Uh, it's ha sometimes hard to swallow that advice, um, but, but- Especially from, because they're younger. <laughs> but we're all, I mean, we're such good friends and you know, we all, we all love taking advice from each other and, and do very, very regularly, so. I do that with my husband too. I'm like, can you read this script? Do you think this is good? What do you see in it? And he literally, Mark, will be on set with me and I'll be like, can you go watch this take? And then pull him aside afterwards and be like, what do you think I should do? Should I try something different? And he's amazing. He knows when I'm like in my head and he can help calm me down and he gives me suggestions. And it's really such a gift to have that.